Если мы продолжаем с вами проходить Элла и Нуар, в прошлой серии мы остановились на моменте, когда нам нужно было ехать you know the way. You can drive. Джеку Келса. Я думаю, вы помните его. Я смотрю в предыдущей серии, что Джек и Коул отнюдь не лазили во время войны. Голдрик? Hello, Jack. This is Detective Roy Earl. Hello, Cole. We would like a word. Would you like to come inside? Actually, we'd prefer if you'd come downtown with us. Do you mind? Do I have any choice? No. You don't. Are you going to tell me what this is all about? It would be better for all of us if we discussed it at the station. Bad move, Cole. How have you been, Jack? Cut the crap. You pick me up in front of my apartment like a common criminal and then expect small talk? Fuck you. И как и в армии они продолжают, по-прежнему точнее, не могут повалить. Ну. Вообще по видео ставкам мы знаем, что Джек тут замешан. Сколько у нас вопросов к нему накопилось. Ага. Так, партия морфина. Do you know that there's a gang war going on in LA trying to recover that stolen morphine? That has nothing to do with me. Is anybody making coffee soon? Hmm, we just know what you have. It's obvious. I'm sure it would be gripping to hear more of your life story, boys, but the truth is, I don't give a fuck. You were on the boat, Kelso. What happened? Do you really think a bunch of Marines could muscle in on the dope rackets in this town? Between the vice squad and the mob, I hear it's pretty sewn up. You'd better watch your mouth. No, I'm too proud, Roy. Did you know that Eddie McGoldrick recently came into money and bought a nightclub? No, I didn't know that. Hmm, а вот сейчас он вроде такое лицо, как будто бы он и не берет. Ладно, поверим ему. And you didn't know that some mobsters blew his brains out last night. No, I didn't. Ну, надеюсь, ты искренне сожалеешь. Так, оружие. You heard that a crate of VARs went missing? No, I didn't. Снова у него такое лицо. Вроде бы и не вряд. Вообще, я думаю, просто давить на него нет смысла, потому что он из тех парней, которые пошлет скорее нас куда подальше. Попробуем по-хорошему. Are you going to tell me what's going on? Or do more innocent people have to die? Yeah, and what's in it for you, Cole? Newspapers? More glory? Another promotion? Another medal at the expense of men who fought for their country? Count me out. What do you know about the army surplus robbery from the Cool Ridge, Jack? What I know is that on three separate occasions you would have been dead if it weren't for me. I don't know anything about the robbery. People are dying because morphine intended to help servicemen is being used on the street. Now we have guys from our old unit. 
being killed by mobsters. We can put two and two together, Jack. Gratitude isn't a concept that has much effect on you, is it, Cole? Answer the question, Jack. Let's get this over with. I was interviewed when the robbery took place. I don't have anything further to add. Jack, we just want information. Bullshit, Cole. Did you seriously believe that dragging me down here would get me to give up my own guys? Do you call yourself a Marine? Trying to make a name for yourself with this shit heel? Look at this chump with this $200 suit and $2,000 car. The tough guy act is really impressive. I like you, Jack. I'd like to make you for this. I really would. I'm going to be working on it and keeping an eye on you. You can go now. Shooting Robert Steiner, 6780 West Sunset Boulevard. The victim is a Chris Majewski. Another name from the manifest? Боже, еще один убитый пехотинец. How many more friends of yours are gonna get plugged today? Да похоже много вы. Talk about tension. That was like being trapped in an elevator with a married couple who can't decide whether they love each other or hate each other. We go back a long way. You went too easy on him. Next time, you leave it to me. I know how to handle that smug son of a bitch. You don't. Jack will never give up his own men. Jack тоже с одной стороны парень, конечно, такой преданный. He just walked up and shot the man. Two of them officers, they went that way. Go on, get after him. He would never get involved in something like this. Oops. We brace him and drag him downtown. Won't work. He's a tough customer. I can't take the shot from here, Cole. Hit him! Clear this asshole off the road. It's no good. We need to get closer. Keep it steady and I'll try to bust his tires. Hit him, Cole. Spin him out. Step on it, huh? Just give me a little closer. Can't hit a target that isn't there, Phelps. Hey. Open fire. Да. И судя по всему, он тоже из Браунинга сейчас по нам полил. Посмотрим, что у нас. Что-то есть. LAPD file. We have a traitor in our midst. All of the names on the list have a hit team assigned to them. Cohen is meeting with Sheldon tonight. We need to get to those guys fast, otherwise there'll be no case. Stop. We have to look at damage limitation. We can't allow that strumpet Brenda Allen to bring down the whole administration. 
We've got to put a lid on the press. Can someone talk to Harry over at the Times? It's too late. The Times would look ridiculous if we dropped the story now. Who is this Stoker? Stoker's a lily white. Nothing that will fix this in the short term. My law and order credentials are disappearing as we speak. Can we get Brenda to leave town? Yes, we can, but she won't go quietly. Brenda has extensive records. Can she at least lay low? That's already been taken care of. Mayor? District Attorney? Who is this guy? And what does he want, Horrell? The name's Roy Earl, detective, administrative vice. Aren't you one of the clowns that got us into this mess? Oh, I think that the orders regarding Brenda come down, not up, Mayor. I have a human interest story. It involves a certain LAPD cop, a hero from the war, who has let his beautiful wife and kids down, who has betrayed America for a German junkie whore, who has abandoned his pledge to the LAPD and his commitment to the public we all serve. Could be all over the papers by tomorrow, and you would be off the hook. So what do you want in return, Roy? Fingering a fellow officer. Ach, ty smolech, eh? Не, ну, конечно, я согласен, с одной стороны, что Кол, мягко говоря, плохо поступил, что имея жену и детей, взял и переспал с этой немкой. Но, Рой, сволочь, не из добрых явно побуждений ты это сделал-то, а? А чтоб себя прославить. Блин, почему ты пистолет убрал? Я бы сейчас ему бошку прострелил, честное слово. Хотя бы вмазать ему нельзя. Что после такого-то? Сволочь. Так. Почему я не могу ничего с этим трупом сделать? В смысле, я по нему хожу, но не могу его смотреть. Ну, видимо, нельзя. Да. Походу мы попали. Серьезно, Хелпс. Говорил я тебе. You drive. I need to go over the case notes. All right, where to? Вася ты, Вася, блин. Нафиг ты с ней переспал? Да что такое? Ну, ты жена, дети. Taking out all the guys from the ship. Why? How does I get them the dope? They obviously don't know who has the morphine, and they're waiting for someone to crack. Да. Ну, это конечно сволочь, сволочь. Steer him off the tar. You and us snow fuck on you. It's no good. We need to get closer. Getting close. Steer him off the tar. Step on it, huh? Just give me a little closer. Hit him, Cole. Spin him out. Yes. I'll try for the tires. Keep your foot down. шляпы явно не идет находиться да. не успели мы спасти you're behind the wheel do we know where we're going и узкое почтовое отделение осталось у нас хм. даже с ром что-то не разговаривает 
Я бы после такого явно бы не молчал. Так, тут похоже тоже. Отдыхайте, ребят. Может, вы гангстеры, но вы не очень-то крутые. Так. Эй, да он живой. Эй, погоди. Нехорошо получилось, что мы его лицо рассматривали, когда он еще живой был. Олар Бер Айс Компани. Really did it. Wonder whether it was worth it. Most people never get the chance to be rich. Wouldn't you risk it? Я не могу посмотреть. Только на другую руку. Так, ну тут явно ничего нет. Так, нужно посмотреть, я думаю. Какого-нибудь из этих. Какого-нибудь из этих громил. Like Sheldon is bringing his own fire team with him. Juicy, Beckett, Goldrick, Driscoll, these are good guys. Why did they get wrapped up in this thing? No. Not everyone has your unwavering restraint in the face of temptation, Cole. Ой, ты б молчала. На, жалко, ребят. Вернулись с войны и такое вот. This isn't looking good. I feel like the fat kid at the back of a race. You sure it's Cohen making the hits? All fingers point his way. Your buddies are in way over their heads. Being a Marine doesn't mean shit out here. Run 
for it after them. А вот и главный зачинщик, судя по всему. Как мы помним, по видеовставкам все-таки он был основным зачинщиком всей этой кутюрьмы с морфином. Корни, корни, корни. Рой! In my office, if you please. I'm working a major case. I'm that close, Cap. It's gonna have to wait. Let Phelps do the interrogation. But, Cap, no buts. This is more important. Что-то мне это не нравится, Phelps. Poor guy must be going crazy. Так, куда мне? You're an interview too, Phelps. You know you've made it if you got that death. There's a quack in there. Sheldon, is this your attorney? No, detective. This is Dr. Harlan Fontaine. He came down here to help me out. How do you do, sir? You stole the morphine from the Cool Ridge. You can't prove that. Let's see if I can try. And what is your relationship to Sheldon, sir? Tudor mentor. Mr. Sheldon is a medical student of mine. He has a very bright future. Oh, that's nice to know. Too bad all of your war buddies won't get to see your graduation. I would have asked Beckett or Majewski or Driscoll about their involvement, but that's difficult, considering they're all dead. That leaves you, Sheldon. You can't blame their deaths on me, Phelps. You're lying, Courtney. The other guys aren't smart enough to attempt something like this. You either give it up, or I go after Jack for it. And how do you prove that, Cole? Тем более у нас есть... Так, у нас было где-то... Собственная книжка, записка, которая говорится... У Кортни Смики. We know about your showdown with Cohen. We found notes on your guys. Cohen is hitting our old... He believes we have the morphine. I told him that we don't have it. And that's the truth. Isn't it, Doc? I believe, Mr. Sheldon. I think he's telling the truth, detective. Да мне как все равно, что ты думаешь. Тем более это мы знаем, какой ты, блин, доктор. Так, ну вопрос у нас мало последний. You were on the ship, Sheldon. Yes, that's correct. So you had opportunity. But it doesn't mean that I was involved. Что-то. So you don't mind that the mob executed McGoldrick, Driscoll, and Beckett to get to you? I don't know why you're trying to pin this on me. Where's your proof? What that was? Признание Беккета. Beckett had a message for you before he died. Bad luck. It was worth a try. I feel bad about Beckett, Phelps. He was a hard charger. Those guys deserve more. I don't blame them for taking their shot. Have you finished, detective? I'm just getting started. You have an answer for everything, Courtney. Let's hope Jack does, because now I'm going after him. Is there anyone you're not prepared to sacrifice? Jack is not in this. He's a good guy. You were Jack, Courtney. I don't care who goes to jail. I just want the morphine off the street. What are you offering, Cole? Don't be ridiculous, son. This man is gambling. What's your offer? 
Doctor. Good to see you. I'm conducting an investigation. Upstairs in my office now. This man is about to confess. As of now, you're suspended from duty, pending a fitness review. What are you talking about? You heard the man, Phelps. Upstairs and face the music like the hero you were. Ah, we, Billion. That's what my man has full detected. Phelps, you're one of my favorite sons. You've broken this old man's heart. Sir, what is going on? Here? You're suspended, Phelps. And over your badge and gun. Don't keep him waiting. What is going on here? Your wife's attorney has pictures of you and the German. Compromising pictures, Rod. She's pressing charges. You'll be formally charged with adultery. A criminal cannot serve as an LAPD officer, as I'm sure you're aware. I don't understand. How could you do it, lad? Your wife, your children, consorting with the enemy and a dope fiend at that. You're lucky the war is over. You'd be taken out and shot. The department doesn't need this kind of publicity, Phelps. Hand over the gun. Keep your head down until your board hearing. I forbid you to make any comments to the press. What the hell were you thinking? Молчали бы, а? Уроды, я извиняюсь. Использовали, блин, Фелпса для своей выгоды. Marie, listen, Marie, I need to explain. Please leave. You're upsetting the girls. Let me see them, Marie. They're my daughters. Go to her, Cole. You have done enough damage here. Do you want me to call the police? For God's sake, Marie. Can't we at least talk? What is there to talk about? Do you love her? Do you? What were you thinking? What about our children? Can you imagine what this has been like for them? Go away, Cole. My father has hired an attorney and you will be hearing from him. I'd like to explain, Marie. I'd like to tell you what I've been going through. What you've been going through. I have had reporters camped out on the front lawn all morning. I can't stand it, Cole. Да, конечно, репортеры перед домом это ого-го как страшно. Хм. Проклятые, блин, журналюги. Да. В какой-то момент, когда Шелдон собирался признаться, точнее, ну, собирался согласиться на сделку некую. Черт возьми, а. Как обидно. Говорил тебе, блин, не стучи, браток. Ай, не послушал ты меня. Хм. Честно говоря, думал, что и она его не пустит к себе. Любовь, конечно, штука тонкая. Дело такое. Так, что такое? Так, я извиняюсь, я без понятия, что там произошло, но что-то в том моменте запись переклинила. И звук стал ужасно отрывистым. Эх, ну что ж. В общем-то, вы сами все видели, говорить тут особо уже нечего. Э, неудачно, мягко говоря, получилось. Очень обидно. Но, к сожалению, опять же, мы ничего поделать не можем. Использовали детектива, с одной стороны, чтобы уметь как-то замять, извиняюсь, то дело. А, ну, с другой стороны, конечно, сам он тоже не ангел, мы это понимаем, но... В общем, в общем, на этом серию мы завершаем, уважаемые зрители. Увидимся с вами в следующей серии. Потому что если вы не успели увидеть, нас не 
просто выкинулись полиции, но вроде как понизили и перевели в другое дело отдел по поджогу. Ну что ж, звучит, конечно, не так интересно заниматься поджогами, как предыдущие наши дела, но посмотрим, кто знает, куда в итоге нас приведет Элей Нуар, потому что, как вы уже, думаю, поняли, сюжет тут весьма непредсказуемый. И разворачивается порой очень интересно, может и неприятно, но интересно в любом случае. Что ж, увидимся в следующей серии, пишите комментарии, подписывайтесь на канал, до встречи, пока-пока-пока.